Hello, I'm uh, Welcome to my studio. I've been uh, writing software since uh, 1977 and now I'm uh, in between artist and programmer. I'm like a kind of uh, digital craftsman. My passion for code, I, I don't know if it's a passion, it just came like this. It's a math teacher who are like uh, teaching us uh, computers on the side and I really enjoy it. And I guess I loved it because I'm not able to play music. So it's a kind of mental, physical disability. It's very difficult for me, but with computers, I can rewrote things. So it's kind of like if software is a way for me to overcome my limitation. Triple Acid is like, the way I build it, is like the holy grail of, of programmers, like generic tool. So to do that, I first, I, I try to make a tool for humans, not for specialists or for programmers. So it's, it's like a Lego where every functionality is in a block and you can take as many blocks as you want and you just like plug in one to the other, the, the way you were plugging a, a stereo system years ago. Except that there is way more blocks and there is way more different blocks than in Lego. Some people call it visual programming, but my uh, AAA seed like a little shift from that because but it's, it's a lot of technical reason, but uh, visual programming is a whole branch where instead of writing software, you take blocks and you connect the blocks one to each other. I can do a lot of different things. I do whatever. On one side, I do what I want to do, and this is mainly art pieces, like interactive things, like I will say something like big toys. On the other end, I do what people pay me for. Usually it's working on events, it's working on show. And uh, in between, I worked on museum things, which are more interesting because usually you get more time to build something really big and interesting. Best example I, I could give in terms of uh, complexity is a, a show which was at La Cité des Sciences in Paris for a year and a half about epidemics. It was a 5,000 square feet area where 80 to 100 people could like come into the area, the projection went on the floor, so as soon as you get into the area, you were followed by a big circle. And this circle was carrying uh, your health, how much life do you have, how much money do you have, and so on. And you were playing to a collective scenario in 20 minutes about different kind of sickness, like the plagues, there were like five different scenarios. I would say it's a more extreme case of what you can do with it. What I'm going to do with Triple AC is a very, very complex question because it's a question I'm asking myself for many years. I spent a few years of my life trying to make it a $5.99 product for kids to play with it, but this requires a very good interface. I think I'm going to go on do, doing production, doing like more and more massive things, and uh, I'm trying to make it open source slowly. But making it open source is not an easy task. It's not just like saying, okay, I put it on the web, it's open source, people can use it. You have to build a community, you have to make sure that people can use it, that it's usable or it's, it's no use.